All right, y'all, the speculation begins, man. Um, Bradley Beal, uh, leading scorer in the NBA right now. Let me see. Bradley Beal putting up. The Wizards actually got the, they got the worst record and the worst defense in the East, at least. Them and the Kings are the only two teams that's giving up 120 points a game. Um, but, like, it's a team sport, though. So, uh, Beal averaging 48% right now, 37 from three. And then uh, 89% from free throw. Those are ridiculous numbers. Shooting guard, 48%. Uh, 35.4 points a game, 5.3 rebounds. Basically, five assists, except 4.9. Um, Bill, how many shots a game are you taking? He only played 13 games, though. But he's taking 26 shots a game. But he's shooting 48%. So, And you look at his team, he don't have really much to work with, honestly. But, um, but anyway, Bradley Bill... Um, I'm about to look it up real quick. This is hypothetical. This ain't no disrespect to the Wizards or nothing, but it's just like Bradley Beal, he's going to get out of there. They, I looked at a stat that had his last 10 40 point games, they all was lost. So he was 0 on 10 in his last, he lost 10 straight games when he scored 40 points. Like, imagine scoring 40 and then still losing 10 times straight in your last 10 40 point game. So, um, let's see if we go to the Lakers. I'm going to see. I know it's hypothetical, but uh, I say Lakers trade rumors on uh, SB Nation. Lakers would love to trade for Bradley Beal, but who wouldn't? Uh, I said the Clippers, too. No, that's what I said. I said he can go to the Clippers, too. But, I mean, you can make it work with three perimeter players. Durant, Clay, and um, what's name did it? Durant, Clay, and, um, and Durant did it. Durant, Clay, and Steph, I mean. So... Uh, but those three unselfish players, I mean, it's the same thing with Bill, Bill, Kawhi, and Paul George. None of them selfish. That'll work. And LeBron, AD, and Bill will be a good. So, wherever team he go to, um, I just say Clippers because, like, if they already got LeBron and AD. So, if it's LeBron, AD, and Bill, I don't think the Clippers got a chance. But if it's uh, Bill, Kawhi, and Paul George versus, like, LeBron and AD, that would be. Um, I think LeBron and them still will win, honestly, though. But it just make it more interesting, though. But oh, let's see. They say Bill has this uh, has this season and next year remaining on his contract with the Wizards. He has a, also has a player option for 2022-2023 that is worth over 37 mil. Uh, clearly, acquiring Bill would uh, require a lot of assets. But both the Lakers and Clippers have traded draft picks in recent years. So that's what I'm saying. I know it's hypothetical, but I just wanted to talk about it. The Lakers gave up three first-round picks when they traded for Anthony Davis, which was well worth it. And the Clippers traded away three of their own first-rounders um, and a Paul, five total in the trade for Paul George. The Wizards are just 3-11. and 11. Basically, saying it's unrealistic that Bill will get, deal, get dealt to them. Uh, they traded for Russell Westbrook during the offseason, but the deal has not panned out as they hoped. I don't know what they expect. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't pick the Wizards to make the playoffs, even when they got Westbrook, honestly. Um, they had a COVID-19 breakout, too, so. They say Bill, just the bottom line of the whole article, Bill is having another great year, but he he may feel that he is um, wasting his prime by staying in Washington. So, if Bill were to force his way out, the Lakers and Clippers would certainly be involved, but it's unlikely that they would be able to conjure uh, up the best offer for Bill. Yeah, I, I agree with that. I mean, teams that got access to teams like Boston, um, the Nuggets, stuff like that. But I don't think the Nuggets will break up their chemistry to to get Bill. You know what I'm saying? Because they still got Jamal Murray, Will Barton. They got some guys that can light it up. So let me know where y'all think Bill should go.